Hello guys and welcome to my channel and today we are playing Idol Farming Empire so as you can see um, I did go to the market I had to watch an ad and I doubt that you wanted to watch an ad with me uh, so that's why I've kind of gone to the market I haven't done anything on the uh, first harvest um, but as you can see we've got a question mark here and I have already completed one of these uh, things right here so I'm going to do that, uh, to unlock some plants, I'm going to actually re, uh, refresh that, but as you can see there's a candy apple uh, over here, I'm not going to get the candy apples at the moment, um, because there's something that I need to do with them first before you do anything, and there's another candy apple there. So we're just going to get some carrots uh, and we're just going to do the exact same thing as we were doing plant. I'm not going to get the candy apple here either, I'm just going to put on max. Um, so if I press max it will go up into the milestone, so 25. Um, so the first one's 25, so and then it will go 50 and it will it will buy as many as I possibly can until I get to the milestone so that's exactly what I want to do uh, we're gonna automate now as you can see besides it it's got like for 10 seeds you get seeds with how much money you actually get before you go to the market as you can see I got 1.42 K uh, so I'm gonna buy um, I'm gonna buy the first one which is 10 seeds which is fantastic the second one uh, I'm going to buy, the third one I'm not going to buy, uh, I'm not going to buy the third one until I get onto the next harvest. Uh, I can buy it, it's just that it's going to take quite a lot of my seeds away. Uh, if it's more than 50% I don't, uh, I just keep it as it is like that. So I'm just going to buy these like so, again I'm going to max them out to 50. Uh, uh, 100. I know that um, it's going to take me quite a bit to actually get to 200, so I'm just going to stick to 100 for the moment. Uh, cows, again, just buy what I can. Uh, again, uh, milestones, remember, you get more money quicker that way. And then I'm going to do the pigs here, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, 100 and then 60 I can only buy up to 60 but I've also completed two of them so as you can see my daily goals I've already completed two of them once I get nine I'll be able to uh, get the rainbow uh, which will be uh, good for me when I do that um, but I'm just focusing trying to get uh, these up to the milestones get as much as I possibly can at the moment uh, strawberries again go on to the strawberry ones keep planting uh, it is quite easier once you get the first one um, first one so what I'm going to show you guys is how I go across all of it so I'm just going to actually uh, get the six plot first before I actually do anything so yeah like so uh, I haven't gone <laughs> gonna take me quite some time to get the sixth plot uh, but I'll be able to do that quite soon I hope uh, but once I do the sixth plot it'll be so much easier for me uh, to do so I'll show you why, why, why the candy apples are so fantastic and uh, what you need to do as well. So I'm going to get the candy apple right here. Uh, so gift open 3.47 bill in gold, which is fantastic. So I'm going to open, I'm going to do that. Okay. So I tend to go around the board. Uh, I'll just do that first. So I tend to go around the board uh, first before I do anything. So... Um, I start off with this thingy over here so I press on that see if there's a candy apple and there is so I click on that so four hour time skip so I press off that I go onto the cloud I see if there's anything there which there's not uh, go on to the daily goals as you can see there's one there so I'll get that one then I go on to this pick 
pitchfork, the farm shop, so I see one there. I go to the settings tab, as you can see, one appears right there. And I also go to the credits, and there's one there. Sometimes they don't go, they don't always show up at the places, so you have to go through the whole thing. But I, I go from one side to all the way around. Uh, we're going to go on to the gems tab and I'm going to press the uh, plant food like that and usually as you can see there's a candy apple there. I don't really want to buy it but that's usually where one is hidden as well so I'm going to press on that. Uh, so now that we've done that we're going to go next to it which is the shoe box. As you can see there's nothing there and these are your collection, your crops, what you can. Uh, shoe boxes are only unlocked once you unlock the nine plot. Uh, we haven't, <laughs> we're not even close to the nine plot at the moment, uh, so I'm not going to focus on that. We're going to go to this one. So as you can see, there's none there. Uh, usually there would be one uh, just above where it says claiming one day. Uh, there's usually one there, but you'll have a look. We'll go on to the sun and uh, it's usually on the banner where it says sunny days there's not one there we're going to go to the player stats where you see the uh, star with your level on usually there's one at the top there but as you can see there's not we're going to go on to the farm shop over here hold on over here if you can see there's three ones now we want to see the top one which is the diamonds and then below is the seeds and usually there's one there uh, but there seems not to be we'll go on to the hot offer as we'll press on the hot offer the panda resource usually there's one by this box right here where the panda is uh, but there's not one there we'll press on the market here and as you can see there's not one there uh, again if we click on the plant button there's usually one where that is so we'll press that one and then the next the last one is where this mole is right here we press on that and you, as you can see there's one over here so we're going to press on that so that's exactly how i do it i go around the board and have a look at that um I'm not sure how long how long it takes to actually, you know, be able to get uh, much quickly. So I, I'm not really focused much on that. But as you can see, uh, I'm getting quite a lot of gold now from the first time I was on. And if I press on the market, as you can see, it says uh, in order to har to go and harvest our crops. Um, we've got 1.39k which is fantastic yes and it will say market opens in you can start it if you want to watch an ad uh, but we're not going to actually do that at the moment um, but there's one thing I'd like to say is because I've got 1.3 for 1k I want to get the 1k after it so I'm going to go out, try and get as much as I possibly can uh, probably uh, I want to get about 2.5k before I actually go back onto the market so that I can buy the 1k without uh, spending half of my uh, <laughs> uh, seeds on it but uh, the, the more the more seeds you get before you go the better it is and don't forget you've got to collect your winnings otherwise um, you know as you can see I've just collected some and it's put my thing from one point I have forgot what it was to 3.72k which don't forget you gotta do that otherwise <laughs> you forget to do it uh, so what's next so the next thing is uh, I, I'm trying to get these as you can see the cut production times and stuff like that uh, but the next thing I want to do is I want to actually get this these potatoes. As you can say, choose a rare crop. The only one we have available until we unlock the shoe boxes are the the ones we've got at the currently. Uh, when it is able to unlock, as you can see, it lights up green. But I'm just gonna go through a couple of things right here. So. As you can see, I've maxed out the stuff. I want to see how much it costs. So, um, 
as you can see, I got 36.71 trill in gold, but as you can see, it will cost me 4.40 bill for the strawberries. Um, because there's a massive difference between what gold I have and what gold it will cost, uh, it means that I don't have to worry about uh, not getting to the more stone. Uh, I'll do the same with the uh, blueberries because, as you can see, 36 trill in gold what we've got, and it's only going to cost me 261 bill such a such a large um oh, what's the word for it such a large difference so i know i can buy that and have it at the milestone and i can do that with that and also again because it's only going to cost me 3.90 uh trill and i've got 36 trill it's going to hit the milestone as well and that'll mean that I get gold much, much quicker than I was originally. Now, you could go around the board and actually do that. Like, again, I can do that, I can do that, and I can do that. But the only issue is, once you keep doing that, you might not hit them all stones. And I don't really <laughs> want to do that. Um, so, <clears throat> so, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to actually get the potatoes. And I know for a fact it's going to cost me 19.9 trill to automate the potatoes. Now you can actually skip some of these. So if I didn't want, if I wanted the next upgrade apart from the production time, I just have to go to the gold tab uh, to do that. Uh, it always brings you to this tab, which uh, it's all right. It'll quickly do it if you want, if you don't mind that. But let's say you don't really want to cut the potato times, you want to go straight onto the potato profits times three. You can buy that without buying the one previously, but you have to go onto the gold tab to do that. Um, so as you can see, I'm just, I'm just doing what I can really. Okay, I know that I can do that. Uh, I know if I buy the potatoes, it's not gonna. As you can see, yeah, it's not gonna because there wasn't a big difference between the gold. You can actually buy it like that, uh, but you know, it's it, it's entirely up to you whether you want to do that. But just being careful because uh, sometimes it's not really worth buying like six of them if you can only buy six at a time. Uh, it doesn't tell you how many you can buy, which is which is one of the problems with this game. Um, you know, it doesn't tell you how many, how many levels you can buy with the max. Um, which kind of sucks, but that's the only thing that I've found which could be better on this game. Um, like so. So, as you can see, I could go around the board and have a look. So, we got a candy apple right there. Uh, which gave me 26 seeds. I'll go around the board like that. So, again... Don't forget, go to the credits, uh, that at the top, right there, okay, not there, not there, not there, not there, or not there. As you can see, you can go around the board. Now, there is a special thing that you can do, which is quite, which is kind of classed as cheating, but I will show you that in a, uh, another episode. Um, is you can actually, once you get all the candy apples, you can actually uh, press the back button, uh, quit the game, go back into the game, and then go around the board and get as many candy apples as you possibly can, and then quit the game, come back in, and keep doing that. I'm not going to do that. Well, I'm not going to do that at the moment. What I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm probably going to do two videos of this game. So, I've got two uh, save menus at the moment. Sorry, give me a sec. Yeah, so I've got two save menus at the moment. Uh, one is uh, currently I'm playing to get to the ninth crop so I can unlock the shoe boxes uh, this one I'm gonna keep as playing relatively uh, safe as in I'm not gonna cheat on it whereas the other gameplay that I might end up doing is I'm gonna cheat on it I'm gonna actually get come out of the game get the candy apples come out get the candy apples 
uh, and that, I'm going to do that when I get the 9 plot and then come back in and show you guys that uh, gameplay as well and show you how quick it can be when I do that but I'm not going to do that at the moment um, uh, I'll probably wait till I get onto the 9 plot on the other one and when I've got quite a few shoe boxes uh, once I've done that uh, I will put it in a different one, I'll put it like, as in, like, when I upload it, I'll put Idle Farming Empire uh, Cheat, uh, so that, uh, and then when the Oktoberfest comes up, goes away, and the Candy Apples goes away, I'll still have this genuine copy that I've been playing uh, to play for you guys, but I just want to show you guys what, how far you can actually do if you do the candy apples but I know that I don't really want to cheat too much so I'm going to keep this version as well uh, sorry if I bored you a little bit with that <laughs> I'm just uh, waiting for my stuff to actually um, save up to be honest because it's going to cost me oh sugar I shouldn't have had oh damn it I shouldn't have bought the uh, uh, or I shouldn't have clicked on the uh, potatoes because I'm waiting for the potato profits at 99t, which is going to take me quite some time, to be honest. Now, I could wait quite a bit. Uh, I don't play this version very much. And the reason for that is because I, I usually like to upload once a day, so it means that I can save up as, as many seeds as I possibly can. Uh, and it's kind of... I kind of have to stop myself from uh, going to market because I want to show you guys as much as I possibly can so that's why I got the other version that I'll be playing uh, and just getting as many shoe boxes and stuff because a load of people are probably wondering what the shoe boxes are so probably in the next episode I don't know whether I'll upload a video today or tomorrow depending on when I uh, do get it on the on the next video uh, or on the other version that I've got, whether I'll unlock nine plots, and I want to get as many shoe boxes as I possibly can from the candy apples. Uh, <laughs> so there is that. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this video here, guys. If you do like the video, then please give it a like. Um, I, I will try and get to a boss clicker episode as soon as I possibly can. Probably tomorrow, or I'm trying to get it on this weekend at some point, but I, I'm still struggling to find out what I want to do for it. But anyway, I hope you guys like the video. Uh, please give it a like if you do, and also um, if you have any questions about this game, then please put a comment in the description, and I'll try and get to you guys as soon as I possibly can. Until next time, I'll see you all soon. Ciao.